hi guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm gonna show you how I created this warm winter inspired make look I only used two eyeshadows so if you want to see how I did this please continue watching so as usual I started with my brows and I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills the brow pomade in ebony and this NYX concealer to carve them out and to prime my face, I used the Benefit Professional and I applied it all over my face with my fingers. For this look, I'm going to use the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. At first, I'm applying it with the Sigma 3D Kabuki brush and then I'm going to use my oval brushes by Goldici Glam and I'm going to blend everything into the skin. And I'm still very happy with these brushes. I use them like every single day. Um, it's very easy to work with and it makes applying foundation easier and quicker of course. And yeah, I just love the finish and how it blends the foundation into your skin. So I'm very, very happy with this purchase. So then I'm going to use this paint pot by MAC in Painterly and I'm going to apply it with a concealer brush all over the eyelids to prep my eyelids for eyeshadow. And for eyeshadows, I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. And for this eyeshadow look, I'm only going to use two colors. So the first one is Burnt Orange, and I'm applying this into my crease with the brush that comes with the palette. And this color is so pretty. I absolutely love it. Um, I also love it as a transition color, as you can see over here. But really, all the shades are very beautiful from the palette. But this one, I think this one is definitely my favorite. And then I'm going to use the second color, which is a red ochre, and that's a beautiful brownish burgundy color. And I'm applying it with the same brush, but then the other side of the brush. And as you can see, I'm really packing that color. So um, I'm applying it all over the eyelids up to my crease, and then I'm going to blend everything together so you won't see any hard lines. For my inner corners, I use the color Primavera to make them really pop. I'm also going to use some highlighter, but you will see that later on in the video. Then I'm going to use this mascara from Rimmel London and I'm applying a few coats on my upper lashes to prep them for falsies. So to highlight and conceal my face, I'm going to use the NYX HD Photogenic Concealer. And this one has become my go-to concealer. I use it like almost every day and I really, really like it. So as usual, I'm applying it under my eyes, on my forehead, the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow and on my chin. And I'm going to blend everything out with this oval brush by Lily Galici. And then I'm going to blend everything into the skin with my damp beauty blender.
then I went back in with my foundation brush because it looked a little bit too white. I think I used a bit too much of the concealer. Um, and then to set everything, I used the Makeup Studio Translucent Powder. But I don't know how, I just lost the clip. I couldn't find it anywhere. But this is the powder that I always use. So then I took this Maybelline Matte Ink Liner and I applied just a little bit onto the inner corners. And for falsies, I used House of Lashes in Noir Fairy. And then it's time for contour and I use this duo stick by Maybelline and I'm applying it as usual on my cheekbones, my jawline, my forehead, a little bit on my nose and also a little bit under my lips. And to set all those areas, I'm using this Maybelline Master Sculpt in number 2. And to finish off my eyes, I'm going to use the same colors on my lower lash line. So first the color burnt orange and then red ochre. And then I'm going to apply a few coats of this Rimmel London Mascara on my lower lashes. And then it's time for lips and I use this lip liner from Primark which is actually kind of good. Um, I'm not sure which color it is, I will write down everything uh, in the description box down below but I really like the color so that's the lip liner that I used and for liquid lipstick I used the NYX Suede Lip Cream in Soft Spoken my favorite favorite color for like every day <laughs> um, and then I totally forgot to apply highlighter <laughs> so for highlighter I used this a MAC Soft and Gentle um, and I applied it with this Real Techniques brush as usual on the highest points of my cheeks my cupid's bow um, and also a bit on the brow bone So this is the final result, I hope you all enjoyed, if so please click on thumbs up, share and subscribe and for all the makeup details please check out the description box down below and I just want to take a moment to thank everyone from the bottom of my heart because today my YouTube channel reached 10,000 subscribers, it's crazy, 10,000 subscribers. So I just want to thank everyone for all the love and all the support, thank you so much. I have lots of videos coming up, so I hope I will see you guys in my next video.